Right, so hey guys, I just recently posted a new speed art of this background here. It's a really, I think it's a really cool and simple background, a really nice one. And yeah, this is just a really short tutorial on how to change the text here, because it's a bit tricky. So, as you can see, the text is here, so what you're going to do is just delete the text. And you're gonna create a new document. I'm gonna uh, change it to 1280 by 720. Just to have a nice big canvas to work with. Then I have already loaded it up, but then you're gonna need this paper check texture, which uh, which I will leave in the description for you guys, and in my speed art also. So yeah. Then you're gonna take the texture, this, and drag it onto your canvas first, and just rotate it so it fits. Yeah, that's nice. Then you're gonna take the text tool, change, use wherever, whichever font you want. I'm gonna use Babus. Then you're just gonna type in whatever you want, and I'm gonna type in to tutorial just for now I'm gonna type yeah tutorial and why the hell is this text so gigantic well yeah as you can see here is your text I'm just gonna change the color to black there we go alright so then you wanna control or command click on the little thumbnail here on your tutorial thingy and then you get this mask thing just gonna delete the back delete the background and what the hell man okay just gonna delete delete fuck you now delete this mark the text again go select this layer go to select modify expand expand it by 15 pixels then when when you wish when you have this layer selected hold control or command and control or command C then create a new layer control or command V and as you can see you have the paper here paper backing for the text then hold control or command again and select the text now drag both both of them to your to your uh, template and let's just fit screen here as you can see now rotate it resize it like that drag it under the air and And then I'm just also going to leave you some uh, tape brushes, which is really nice. Little voice track there. You can see it's a really realistic uh, tape. And yeah, that's the tutorial. Then you're going to add some layer styles and stuff if you want. So select the both layers again, merge them together by holding Ctrl or Command E. And then you're gonna create a new layer up on top of the text go onto your brush and select the brushes that I have uh, given you in the description resize them make sure the color is white and there you go rotate it put it in place As you can see you have the As you can see there you have a really nice tape. And yeah, this has been Streamline Studios, and peace out.